we can look at biological systems much like computer networks. And because we have so much experience today with hardware, with software, with large-scale computing networks, we're actually learning about our biology through the building out of these systems. In fact, if you compare across computing versus and, and life, essentially, we find a lot, of, a lot of things that are identical. And it's not surprising, digital code. We have, there's open standards. There's modular code. It's actually already object-oriented. There's error protection systems and data compression and on and on. But it's not really surprising when you think about it because engineering, uh, well, we want to use, we want things to work faster and more efficiently and use less energy. And nature's trying to do the same thing too. It's just taking a roundabout way and different material, building materials to do it. <laughs> 